hi guys welcome back to my channel i'm really excited for today's video because it's going to be talking about fashion like i'm not a fashionable person but i'm trying this video is going to be talking about she and all so for the purpose of this video we are going to pretend as if they just arrived because i got most of this cloth between last year like ending of last year and the beginning of this year and whenever my clothes arrive i do not keep them in the box like i have to literally take them off then put the plastic and the cotton in um um, what is it called? Recycle. Is it recycle? Yeah, recycle. To be thrown out the next Tuesday. So I just kept this for keeping purpose. And well, so yeah. Well, today is going to be about modest fashion. And before anyone comes for me, you know, you define modest in your own way. What is modest to me might not be modest to, you know, a Muslim woman and um what is modest to me might not be modest to my neighbor or my sister or anything so it's quite relative so i don't know people look at this topic as someone judging but it's just a personal preference so um before now when i was in school my idea of fashion well i wasn't thinking of fashion because I barely have time to even do anything so what i usually do was have two pair of jeans a couple of t-shirts and wake up take my bath throw on a pair of jeans throw on a t-shirt and call it a day and i was in business school so the only day i got to dress up was uh, like presentation day in business school we do a lot of presentations so that's the only day i got to dress up so up until last year when i graduated my wardrobe just had t-shirt jeans and maybe two or three uh, outfits for church and presentation so well this was a big moment for me and finding modest clothes is quite difficult i'll tell you i remember when i was in italy my friend and i went to h and we saw this sleeveless dress which was below the knee you should have seen the excitement in our faces because usually you don't see anything like that usually it's like mini skirt mini dresses and for some reason i'm always quite shy so i don't like any attention also i used to like put on just black because i, I used to feel like by putting on black i wouldn't draw any attention to myself and i didn't like like putting on so many colors but Look at this. I've come a long way. I can actually put on red and step out of the house. <laughs> well, that's what I call growth. So this is the first piece and I absolutely love it. Um, I'm actually experimenting with colors and this helped me do that a lot. It's actually pretty thick. So it was particularly good for when we had the minus 40 weather here in Alberta. So I also pair it up with a belt. It gives it a bit of shape, a bit of structure. And I got the belt from Shein as well. Well, I love this dress. For this next dress, I haven't actually worn it yet because it's suitable for spring or fall and i can't wait during the winter month so well as you can see it has an elastic waist and the same material on the neck also elastic and if i pair this with um, heels it's gonna look absolutely gorgeous i actually like the material a lot and it's like black polka dot this is more suitable for church. Oh, this is one of my favorite. It's mainly for work. It's a two-piece dress. You have this um, bottom part and then this top part that you can detach. I actually like the style a lot. It's pretty fancy, you know, and it meets my dress code at work. So I absolutely love it. And 
And yeah, I always make a mistake. Usually I have to like take it out and put it on again backwards. I usually don't know where to put in the front. So anyway, it's a very stunning dress and it's like a wine color dress. Okay, I don't care what anybody has to say, but whenever I put on this particular dress, I feel like I have like an hourglass figure and no one can tell me otherwise. I love the fit overall. I love the colors. It's not so bright. It's not so dark and it fits really amazing. I mostly wear this to work as well because it's quite comfortable and it's a thick sweater dress. I mostly wear sweater dresses to work. So that's it. Okay, now this black dress is quite simple and can be styled however you want. It's a black dress, so you can combine any color you want with it. And it fits me like a glove, which I absolutely love. I always feel like a million buck inside this dress, so and no one can tell me otherwise. I love this dress. I was quite surprised with this purchase. I wasn't sure how it, how it was going to look like on me, if it was going to be showing some things I didn't want to show, but it's pretty great. Okay, so Sheen really surprised me with this skirt. Like, I absolutely love it. It's a circle skirt and the waist is like corset. I enjoy doing that, by the way. So I, I, I really love it. I really, really love it. I can wear it to work. It's not too fancy for work. And it's not too simple for church. Those are the only two places I go to. I don't really go out. So this is a very good piece. So I'm just going to show you the waist up close. It's really beautiful. And I like how it's tight in the waist and then full all the way down. I really love this piece. Now onto a more churchy look. This skirt, I also got it from Sheen and I was surprised, very surprised, pleasantly so, but I was surprised. It fits so well and it looks so good and <laughs> I've been wanting to like swirl around so this dress helps me with that. Anyway, I like the color, like I like that uh, it's bright, mm -hmm. it's bubbly. I absolutely love it. And that's me trying to give you some styles. I'm very awkward in front of the camera. So <laughs> this is actually quite funny to me. And that's ironic because I make YouTube videos and I'm shy to stay in front of the camera. But I'll get over it. So I also got this shirt from Shein. It's very elegant and it goes well with a lot of my skirt. I like the detail on the neck. I like how you can tie it on the neck and the colors go perfectly with this skirt I showed you earlier on. So this skirt is also a church piece and I love it. I just I was surprised but I read a lot of reviews and people seem to like it so I decided to take a chance on Sheen and I'm glad I did. It's a circle skirt and it has this big waistband and some buttons in the front so you like um, make it look fancy I guess and it always looks very elegant especially when you wear it with heels which I'm still learning to use. So I'm just coming closer so you can see the waist, how nice it is, how it defines my own waist and, you know, makes me look like I'm not like a potato sack at all. So the next piece is this paper bag waist skirt. I love this, like it looks so elegant. I mostly wear it to church because I can't be jumping inside the bus to work with this. So I don't wear it with this top. But I wear it with something colorful on the top. I absolutely love it. It has a slit at the back and 
distress skirt. It's simple yet very elegant. So this is what the waist looks like. It kind of make you look like you have a smaller waist when you put on this skirt. I don't know how it does that, but it's pretty great. Now onto this skirt. It's also a church skirt. It also has a um, slit at the back like the former um, paperback waist skirt. It's supposed to have suspenders, but I can't find where I put the suspenders and I just decided to make this video with it. And like the other skirt, it's also accentuate your waist. I'm going to show you up close. It has some decorative buttons outside and also some buttons inside the skirt, which where you like attach the suspenders, which I cannot find. I need to look for it because it makes it look so good from the picture I posted earlier on. And this is the white version of the other yellow um, yellow shirt I showed you earlier. And it goes with anything. So this is the final piece. This wine colored top. A blouse actually. It falls on the body so beautifully. Like, just take a look at that. You see how the back falls off. I didn't do the belt very well, so like the back falls so beautifully, and I like how long it is. I love it a lot. It's it's a beautiful piece, and it actually feels so quality, which I was surprised because I'm always nervous about quality when it comes to sheen. And that's all. Welcome back, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you like that video, remember to click the thumbs up, subscribe and i'll see you in my next video bye